Manisa is with us in Austin, Texas. Hi, Manisa. How are you? Hi, Dave. I'm doing good. How are you doing? Better than I deserve. What's up? So I was calling because um, you don't know this, but you your book helped me to get out of credit card debt. Good for you. So I, thank you. I started with my, by myself trying to, to take care of myself, and then I showed my, my parents, but they were skeptics. Uh, my mom finally got on board, and then my dad got on board, and so we, we no longer have credit card debt. Um, however, now we're in the dilemma where the house that we purchased was a wreck, so we had to sell it to an investor, and we're in limbo. We don't have anywhere to go. The, the housing market is, is so bad, we, we keep getting outbid for houses. Uh, we tried buying a trailer house, and there's issue with land. So I'm, I'm thinking I needed to go directly to you to find out how do I invest so that I can build my wealth I know I, I, you're, one, of, one of the sections in your book says to get uh, an emergency fund uh-huh. and then do 401. Of course, I had already had my 401, and, but I, for some reason, I can't get the $1,000. Uh-huh. I can't even get $100, so, and I don't know what that is. So I was hoping uh-huh. maybe you can lead me in the right direction. Okay. Uh, who's we? Your parents and you are doing all this together? Yes, I try to do it on my own. I, I thought I read the book. I mean, I no, I mean, you're to, like you're like the house you own. You own with your parents. Yes, we did, but we we had to sell it because it was it, so it's sold. Apart. So you don't currently own a house with your parents. No, sir. We we were trying to buy one. Good. Don't don't we, don't own a house with your parents. How old are you? I'm fifty two. Don't own a house with your parents. Well, I, they they need me. Well, they, they, they can get a place to rent. You can help take care of them, but you don't need to own a house with your parents. That's a, This is a bad plan. Um, yeah, I completely agree with you. <laughs> okay, good. Then don't do it. I agree with you. Yeah, so, so okay. how much of the money, did you get money from the sale of the other property? Um, because we had to sell to a, a home investor, we didn't really get that much, but we have $15,000. You have how much? Um $15,000. Okay. E- and so you have 7500 for them and 7500 for you, right? Uh, well, they can have all of it. I, I, I mean... You're going to give them all of it. Okay. Then what yeah, do you make a year? Um, about 41000 Okay. And how did you get out of debt? We just did your baby steps. We took Well, that's baby step one's $1,000. You said you couldn't do that. Well, they're not... We, we, that, so I've been trying to to do that, but every time something comes up that we need to start taking the money out. And okay, there's not a we. Anything. You're 52. Yes, sir. There's a true. them and a you. Yes. There's no we. Yes, sir. Okay. So you make $41,000 a year, and how yes. did you pay off credit card debt? Well, um, so at first... You, it was you got on a budget, and you found money in the budget, and you put it on the credit cards, right? Well, uh, what I did was is that we took all of the bills, and the, the one that was the lowest, we just split the, the, the balance three ways, and we, we paid that. And then we paid, we, we did that for each one of the bills until we got them all paid off. Okay. All right. So you found a mon- money in your personal income to apply to the debt, correct? Yes. Yes, sir. So that's how you do your $1,000. Only now it's okay. going to be you. And you need to go find an inexpensive place to rent, give them the 15000 set up your life, and begin to work the baby steps with a written budget. You're not doing a budget, and you need to start doing a budget immediately. So get on every dollar and download the, uh, the world's best budgeting app and get your, get your budget going to where you are doing this. But, Manisa, you have to separate. You can love mom and dad, but you're 52 years old. Time to move out of your mother's basement. Time to quit sharing bills with your mom and dad. It is way past time, unless you have some kind of a a mental disorder that doesn't enable you to live on your own. But you need to do that, and you need to do it now. And I don't think you do, based on talking to you. Yeah, I I would just add one thing, Manisa, that I want you to ask yourself. You said, they need me, but I wonder how much you need them, and you're not even aware of how much they're a safety net for you, for you not to truly fly and to do what you're supposed to be doing. I think you've got to really confront that. I think at 52, it's time, as Dave said, for you to strike out and do your own thing. And 
at forty-one thousand dollars a year, you can get that a thousand dollar emergency fund pretty quickly yeah. and move through this, and before you know it, be truly in a great place financially. Yeah, get the least expensive thing. Don't buy a trailer. They go down in value. Get the least expensive thing you can get to rent. Get yourself started. Get, and take all the extra jobs you can take and get on a written budget and begin to build the thousand dollars and then work your way on up through all of the baby steps and you'll be just fine. You can do this.